for viewing pleasure. All right, Bob and Weave right here. Going. Abs are nice and tight. Remember, you're bobbing and weaving, making sure that you're going under that wire, kick, whatever that visual is above your head. Good. Add a side leg lift right here. Add a flurry with the arm. Abs are nice and tight. Seven. Six. Four more. We go to squat. Down and up right here. Now you can pick up the pace here. Come up on the toes. Good. Up. Warm up those calves. Good. Four more. Three. Two. Hands behind the head. Good mornings here. Down and up. Not too fast. We want to think about hinging at the hip, keeping that chest open, elbows back, abs in nice and tight. Four more, three more, two, and one. Give me a football run here. Good, take it in and out. Nice and light on your feet. You punch those arms forward. Get that core temperature up a little bit here. Good. We're gonna alt lunge and punch it down. Four, three, two, one, watch me. Drive that elbow down. Again, you can go a little faster than the music. The music today is a little quicker. It's 140 beats per minute. So you just go do your own pace. Eight, seven, six, four. Three, jack it out right here. Lower high, remember low your right here. Again. Drop squat, here we go. Take it down, up, down, up. Remember, side to side is fine. One drop squat, two jack. Drop it, jack, jack. Drop it. It's not exactly to the beat of the music. Down. Up. Good. Two more. Last one. March it out. Good. Squat, crescent knee. Chest is up on the squat. Want to get that hip flexor nice and warm. Core is warming up. Hold your squat, pulse it down. Flurry those arms. Little jump right here for eight, seven, six, four more. Low high squat, no jump. Take it down, up, down. Work those hands towards your toes. Going deeper in that squat. Good. Pull the next one down. Walk it out. Walk it out to that plank. Rock forward and back. Woo. Just moving back so you guys can see me. Four more is four. Three, two, hold it here, hold it. Give me 10 mountain climbers, quick. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, downward facing dog. All right, from here, we're gonna go to plank and you're gonna take your right hand, tap the outside of that left ankle, other side. Now, we're just starting here. So if you can't reach that ankle, then just go to that 
outer shin. Come back to that plank every time. Sorry, my necklace is getting caught in my mouth. <laughs> so just take this back and forth. And we're warming up that core. Four, three, two, and one. Come into that plank. Give me plank punches right here. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Walk it in. Good job. Pull those shoulders back. Big circles. Grab some water. We are ready to go. Whew. All right. First one, everything's gonna be 30 to 45 seconds. I'm just gonna lower the music a little bit. Make sure you take in a little water here. Good. Squat, kick, squat, jump, or just squat? So it's squat, kick, squat, jump. Just getting started here. Like I said, everything will be kickbox inspired. Like to jump, just do an extra pulse to a kick, just like that. You can also substitute a knee here. The next thing we're doing is a walkout, two plank punches. Not yet. Letting you know where we're going. Four, three, one, walk it back to your space, walking it out, bend those knees, walk it out, we have two plank punches, walk it in to a jump, okay, we're jumping when you walk it in, eyes at your hands, down on the mat, gaze, two nice strong plank punches, bend those knees, walk it in, jump, take these at your own pace, how are we doing? Woo. I'm not issues today. Keep going. Good. Nice big jump. Good. Next jump, we're just going to hold those squat jumps. But only 30 seconds. Those arms up. Third spine. Or you can lift up on those toes. Nice strong arm. Elbows come back. Shoulder blades in your back pocket. Ten seconds. Three, two, one. All right, walk it out to a plank. Going to downward facing dog. Lift your right leg up. Bring the knee in. Jump three. And then repeat. So three-legged dog, knee in, jump two, three. Reach up, these are quick guys. So three little mountain climbers to switch. Think about driving that knee in. One, two, three. It's only three, no excuses here. We really want to get that knee in. One, two, three. Yes. Come on, one, two, three. Woo! Nice stretch for that glute and hamstring. Don't rush through it. Make sure you get to that plank right here before you do your three jumps. Four, three, two, one. Finish it, bring it in. Woo! Wrist circles if you need it. Speed bag, get it going. Fast tails, heels. If you don't like the jump, really just go fast and tap, tap, tap. Good, get those arms up. Remember, it's a speed bag, not a flurry, it's here. You can't, that's fine. This is fine, Gene's got a good option here. I didn't know if you heard me. God knows, today I've been having technical difficulties. 
you can even punch it out. Come on. Feel your core here. Woo. Eight, feel those shoulders. Four more, three more, two more, one. All right, left leg forward. Four uppers, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, one, two, three. One, two, three, four, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Again, we're working in threes here. So you're always got a different foot forward. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. If you don't like that, just switch your feet, okay? Just switch your feet without the jump. Make sure you're not doing this on the uppers, okay? We're not doing this, okay? Tight, tight. Get those elbows in, come on. Tight. Four, three, two, one. Fast jabs, fast feet. Feel the fire here, low impact. Great way to get that heart rate up. I like my palms facing each other. Fast. Come on. Get that arm all the way out there. Show me your muscles. Come on. Woo. Can you move your feet faster? Come on. Breathe. Abs are in. Rock solid. Come on. Shoulders relaxed. Come on, punch it out, play around with your grip. You can do some with your palms down, some with the palms in, maybe some with the palms up. Come on, feel your core here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Feet apart, high low two times, squat jump in the center. High low two times, Jumps in the center. Let's do two. So the high low, you're just going down into that squat. So I want you to work on your depth. Come on. So when we only do two squat jumps, that's the time we can really fine tune it. And I want you to really punch high low on those two high lows and get low into those legs. And then really make your jumps powerful. Good. Always that one hand up and the other arm's punching. They're nice, you can take them at your own pace. Four, three, two. Finish your other side, make it even. Good job, walk it out, nice. Side knee or side kick, burpee. Side knee or side kick, burpee. All right, so we do side kick, bring it down, burpee. Side kick. Remember that toe is on an angle. As you kick to the side, this toe is on an angle. You can also just do a knee, knee. We're ready for it. With all those walkouts we did, you're ready to get down using your strong legs to come down after that side kick. Yes. Make them quick. Hands right under your shoulders. When you burpee back, as you build here, make that kick a little more powerful. Come on, work that side body. Four, three, two, come on up. Woo. Last thing, maybe, <laughs> maybe. All right, all right, arms up, knee in, since you're three, just switch. So it's in, one, two, three, knee, one, two, three, knee, one, two, three, 
So always opposite leg coming up. One, two, three. The biggest thing you have to remember here is after the knee, you tap back. Don't tap it in, tap it back. You got it. Right? Woo. Smash it. Come on. Get angry at it. One, two, three. One, two, three. Put your chest up. Nice and light on your feet. Four, three, two, one. Good job. Get some water. We're repeating with some variations. Adding a couple things, Woo, making some changes. First one, while you're getting your water, watch it first. It's gonna be kick, lunge, kick, two jumping jacks, other leg, kick, lunge, kick. So you start with your feet here, kick, lunge, kick, jack. Kick, lunge, kick, jack. Now you can tap the ground on that lunge. Kick. Lots of cardio today. Don't worry, we're gonna grab those weights in a bit. Good. Next one, hold your jacks. Hold it. Eight, nine, 10, one, two, three, four, five. Remember, to open. Switch your arms. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. Woo! Shoulders down. Five more. We switch, and we're halfway there. Arms up. We're going to one hundred. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten. One. Five more, and we speed the last 25 with speed bag arms. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lower high, ten, nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, five more. Five, four, three, two, and one. You just did a hundred jumping jacks. Walk it out. Woo! All right. All right, burpee. Two plank punches, two plank jacks. In and up. Ready? Two punches, two plank jacks, in and up. Two punch. One, two, and jump. Two punches, two jacks. Don't rush it. We got 45 seconds. Come on. You got this. You got it. Little mind work here too. 
how you know that oxygen's flowing. You can still think. Now, next time you get to those plank jacks, hold them. Hold them. Come on. Give me a ninja here. Oh. Put those hips down as best you can. Really drive that elbow back. Four, three, two, one. Bring it in. Woo. Good job. Woo. Shoulder roll. All right. Woo. Jab cross, jab cross. One switch, not three. Left leg forward. Jab cross. Sorry, jab, cross, jab, cross, switch. Or step in. Now instead of those uppers, you want a jab, cross. You should feel good on your arms. Make sure you're moving that core. So if you weren't using your arms, core would be here, right? Come on. Now, you gotta keep your pace up here. Finish that last punch. The harder you punch, the harder it's gonna be on that core and your heart rate. Finish your last one. Now, just scissors. Good. These are quick, you need speed bags, right? If you don't like these, go here. But this is a little bit different. Now you can bring that speed bag up and down. Not too far down. You don't wanna, you don't wanna strain the back and hunch, but you can, Add a little variety here. Come on. Our arms are gonna be fatigued before we pick up those weights. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold those feet wide. Come on. Yeah. Go low and high. A little sumo. Come on. We did it with the fast feet before. No variation. Full extension. Come on. Get it out there. You're not punching down, you're punching out. Imagine hitting your opponent in the gut. Try not to move your wrist. You want to make it quick. Eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. Arms up. Bob and weave. Two high lows with a jump right, two high lows left. Simple, Simon, right? Here we go. Now, if you don't like this version, go back to where we were with the two high lows. A squat pulse or squat jump. Come on. If you do three, don't worry about it. But remember to get the punch out. You're not here. You really want to use your oblique, use your shoulder. Opposite hand always at your chin. Look at your opponent, that helps. Looking good, guys. Come on. One more. Three more. March it out. Instead of that side kick, burpee, rear kick. So we have one kick behind, burpee, one kick behind. All right. Drop it down. Kick. Burpee. Kick. 
you want to make it more core, do a double burpee. Do in, out, in, out. Or out, in, out, in. Your call. Make sure you're squatting. So remember, it's just one kiss, one or two burpees. Ugh. Make sure when you kiss, you not crouch over your in that pin to get that kick. Okay, we're almost there. Come on, let's wrap this up so we can go to our weighted circuits. Four, three, two, come on up. Woo! All right. Woo! All right. All right. Just one of the knee switch. Arms up. So it's gonna be knee in, back, switch. One instead of three. That's the theme this set. Knee, switch. One. Drive that knee in. One more thing to do after this. Come on. Get loose. Get the core. Hold your head up. Eyes forward. Four. Three. Two. One. Woo. Good job. All right. Jab, cross, hook. Kick, lunge, kick and we switch, all right? Jab, cross, hook, kick, kick, lunge, kick. Other side, jab, cross, hook, this is slower. Kick, lunge, kick. Jab, cross, hook, kick, lunge, kick, switch. Jab, cross, hook, kick, lunge, kick. Take your time, this one is meant to be slow, okay? But I want you to work those kicks and those punches. Kick, lunge, kick, switch. Kick, cross, hook. Any combination you want. I think I just did something different there. Jab, cross, hook. Kick, lunge. One more each side. Feel that heart rate coming down a bit. Okay. Last one. Good. Kick one, switch. Here's your power. Go into the ha hands to the floor. Kick, lunge, switch. Here's your power now. You can also be here. We're here. You don't have to jump, okay? Kick, lunge, tap. Kick, lunge, tap. Hands up or hands down. Lots of variety here. I want to see what you have and get a break after this one. Come on, give me what you got. Push it back heel. Find that balance. Mountain climber switch there. Four, three, two, one. Walk it out. Walk, walk. If you're doing this correctly, you wouldn't take in water right now. You probably couldn't. That's how high that heart rate is. Woo. Wipe it down, wipe your space down. Take a little inventory here. When and if you're ready, grab a sip. Just to wet your whistle. Woo. All right, moving on. I'm turning the page. <laughs> All right. 
breathe. All right. You have strength and cardio. The compound strength is gonna keep that heart rate up. All right. Woo! First one, two weights. I'm gonna go tens here. Just to start, 30 seconds only, rear reverse lunges, pulsing, three coming in. All right, feet apart, chest up, right leg goes back, here we go. Pulse, two, this is just your warm up for what's to come. Keep your chest up. Good. Good. Last one. Come up. Good job. All right. Static. Right leg back. So we're going to go clean. Press. So we hinge at the hip. Drop that back knee down. 45 seconds. Hinging over that left leg. I don't know if we're gonna get to two of everything. I don't think we are. So you can go a little heavier here. But again, that heart rate's up, back heel stays up. My hands are sweaty, so if yours are too, I'm gonna definitely wipe my palms a little bit. Last one, we're gonna put those weights down. Stay in that static. Come down with your fingertips and either up or jump, 30 seconds. Feet stay in the same position. Hinging, lifting. Hinging and lifting. Remember, you don't have to jump. What I don't wanna say is this. I don't want to see flat feet, okay? When you jump, you're jumping into the lunge. So you're here, not here, okay? See the difference? Or just go to non-jump. Four, three, two, end it, end it, good. All right, one weight. Want go heavier here. Wait here. Squat, bicep, squat, press up. We're 45 seconds and then we'll go to the other side. Don't you worry. Ready? Give me that bicep curl in the squat. I want to keep these quick. That's why we don't have two dumbbells. And I want to keep it in the legs. See that time under tension for that curl? Push those hips back. And then really push up. That core should be burning already. If you get a lot of cardio. I'm gonna get you out of here quickly by a quarter till. Don't worry. We started late. Last one. Good. Bring it down. Get your tens again or your dumbbells you were using for that queen and press right leg forward this time. 45 seconds, static lunge, queen and press, followed by the jump. So you know what's coming. Right leg forward. Now I want you to come down, hinge over that right leg, and here we go. 45 seconds. So make sure when you come over that right leg, you hinge. You can even tap 
the dumbbells to the floor as long as you're not rounding the shoulders. Or just let them hover like I am. Get that strong bicep curl in. Yep. Curl press. Feel that right leg. 10 seconds. Don't forget to drop that back knee, that left knee. Little balance challenge if you get tired. Last one. Now put those weights down. Keep that same stance. Fingertips down. 30 seconds either here or here. Now, you can punch it up, but I want those arms up. Straighten. Get that level change. Nice, guys. Find if you need to stagger that stance a little more. Keep it wide. Don't be too far in. Pick up the pace. Feel that inner thigh. Two, four, three, two, and one. Woo. Nice job. All right. Woo. All right. Sumo upright row. Two weights. Upright row. Sumo. Little shoulder work. 45 seconds. Then we go wide grip bent over row. Okay? Sumo, toe turn out. Chest is up, drop it down. Here we go. Inner thigh. Only hinging to accommodate the weight in front of you. So we're not here. How are we doing? You can always do one upright row at a time. No big deal. Whew. Stack that rib cage right over that hip. Feel that inner thigh. Get that chest up. Four, three, two, one. Good job. Put them down. Grab different weights. Remember, we're doing this one time. So you're going to be in that hinge. Feet apart. Wide grip. Bent over row. Palms forward. Start out heavier, then go to lighter. We're only doing it 45 seconds. Woo. Palms forward. Try not to do this. Hold on real quick. Don't do this with your wrist, just pull. Pull the elbow back, not up, back. Use your back. Ready? Go. Now these are meant to be slow. So I would say if you're coming back from an injury and you have light weights, just do them slow. Now, you shouldn't feel any tension in the neck. If you are, a couple of things you can do. Go lighter, or make sure your grip is pulling back, not up. Sometimes the neck takes this a little bit. Nice and slow. Squeeze, the more you squeeze, the better it is. If you need a break for your back, come up, and go back down. Almost there, gang. Four, three, two, put them down. Woo. All right. Two options here. You can do a skater or one foot forward back, 
skate to the other side, other foot forward and back. I'll show you what it looks like. So I'm gonna lift my right leg, forward, back, skate, forward, back, skate. Forward, back, bounce, forward, back, bounce. If you don't like that, skater, it's fine here. Ready? I want you to go quick. Come on. One on one. We did it the other day. Just the one side. This one's a little bit more time efficient. Try to get that opposite knee up. Keep that core engaged. You got it? The reason I look at you guys is to make sure I cued it correctly so that you're getting it. Okay? Gators are fine here as an option. We haven't done much lateral movement, so I really want you to bound. Really use your core, use your inner and outer thigh, use that power. Really go far. Four. Three. Two. One. Good. Woo. We're coming down, building on that. Mountain climbers, 45 seconds. Don't slip. Any ones you want. Woo, ready? So, 45 seconds. What I don't wanna see is this knee coming in here and your butt up. I would rather you not jump like we did in that warm up and drive the knee in. Butt down, please. Good. Bring your weight forward a little bit. That's always gonna help you. You're probably not gonna go out above your hands. So you'll have to keep those hands under your shoulders. Since you're moving quickly here, sometimes the hips move back, away. The shoulders move away from those hands. Come on, keep that knee close to the ground. Anyone you want here. 10 seconds. Remember, don't give up, just go to Slow if you need to. And then finish. Four, three, two, one. Bring it down, sit in the child's pose. Good. Come on up. Get your, get your weight. Not too heavy here. We're doing an ISO skull crasher. We're in the home stretch, guys. All right. Woo. Watch. First, while you're wiping down, getting your weights. Feet down. I want you to concentrate on your triceps here. You're gonna start low. Right arm up, left arm up. Make sure you're not coming here, okay? You start halfway up. You might wanna grab lighter here, okay? It's a little harder, one at a time. One arm is always under tension. You never get that relief. Ready, set, start at that 90 and go. You can always take your couple of practice. I don't want to say swings, but you know what I mean. Feel how hard this is already? Option is Come up, get lighter weights, or hold on to one dumbbell. Keep going. Really go to that full extension, and then just come down to 90 degrees. You're doing great. We are almost there. You gotta use your breath here. This is hard stuff. Use your abs, push your feet into the floor. Do what you gotta do to finish. Keep those elbows right over the shoulders. Don't let them crush into the core. Four, three, last one. Bring it in and up. Woo. Nice. Nice job. Woo. All right. Keeping with that kickboxing theme. All right. We're going to roll down. Legs up. Come up. Four, three, two, one. Down, up. If you want. Out, in, come to that V-sit. You can also 
one, two, three, four, down, up. To make it easier, walk those feet out a little bit. That's gonna help you to come up. Either way, you got one minute of these. And I'm giving you a minute so you can change and try different options. So if you're doing this version, keep your legs together and make sure you're punching across, you're leaning back. If it becomes too much on your hip flexor, go right here. You have a minute. Either way, you're only rolling to the tips of the shoulder blades, your gaze is here, you're not looking up, okay? So keeping it, keeping it fired up here. Try a few different ones. You can even do this one, right? With just the roll down. You don't have to kick those legs out. That could be a lot on the hip flexors. Hip flexors can be tight. You have 10 seconds. So you don't want to aggravate it. Make sure you're twisting across. Shoulders down. Four, three, two, and one. Ooh. Nice job. Ooh. All right, get into a plank. One more thing to do and we're stretching. All right, you're in a high plank. Hands under your shoulders, slow knee to outside elbow, 30 seconds. 30 seconds and then we go to an elbow plank. You're getting a little inner thigh here. Breathe. Come on, be proud of yourself. Be proud of your plank, even if you're just holding that plank. Put those hips down. Last one. Hold your plank, go to an elbow plank. Make sure those hips come down. Tap those knees one at a time, slow. Now, I like my hands apart. Feet are just a little apart. Make sure you're not up here, okay? Bring your weight over the hands, you have, come on. We're doing 30 seconds here too. You're already well into it. Squeeze that core, squeeze it, squeeze it. Squeeze it, squeeze it. Breathe, 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 breathe. We have not stopped. Last two, last one. Hold your plank, take a deep breath in. Let it out. Child's pose. Ah, oh, nice job. Come forward, lift the heart. And go back to child's pose. Take this back and forth a few times. Lifting your heart. Coming back. Nice. Woo. Abs are tight. After this one, come to all fours. Good. Right arm to the side. Look up, hips back, thread the needle. Come back up. Thread the needle. One more time. Thread the needle, hold. Hold. This hand can be behind you for a little chest stretch, shoulder stretch. Come on up, other side. If you wanna sneak in a quick cat and cow here, do it. Other arm up, hips go back a little bit. Under, up, under. Third one is a, a keeper, hold it. And then you can put this hand behind or just keep it right here. Breathe. And come on up, nice. All right, come to that 90-90 stretch. Take it over the front leg, just hold. Ah. 
come on up, either with your hands behind or here. We're gonna switch to the other side and we're gonna go fold over this leg now. Come back, other side. We're gonna make it a little quicker now. One stretch, one up. One stretch, one up. Last one. Come on up. Good job. All right, so cross-legged here or any comfortable seated position, take a twist. This hand, if you have it behind you, is close to your back. Both arms up, big deep breath, other side. Both arms up, hands to your heart. Take a deep breath up, bring it forward. Inhale up, hands to your heart, give yourselves a hand. Whew. All right, great job, everybody.